a very pleasant morning to reverend father manager reverend father principal dear teachers and yes all my dear students watching me out there we have stepped into new academic year 2122 and i am very glad to take this opportunity to welcome you all to this new beginning with positive vibes new hopes new learning and new experiences we all are aware that many of us lost a near and dear ones but life must go on show must go on we need to recover from this intolerable pain and revitalize our lives to recover and revitalize the world the only way is education as we all know education brightens the mind broadens our thinking power inspires us to have scientific attitude and thereby shapes our character and that's why our school has the theme for this academic year 2122 education a powerful means to re- revitalize the world let's be- let's revitalize with double energy and double enthusiasm and resume with lighting of the lamp may i request reverend father manager and reverend father principal to please light the lamp teacher irene please escort fathers for lighting of the lamp may the light of this lamp dispel darkness and sufferings which the world has been facing due to this pandemic let's hope for a new light this lamp will surely illuminate our lives and make this earth once again a better place to live in thank you fathers chalo school chale hum school ke darwaze se duniya ke raaz khulte hain koi aage chalta hai hum piche chalte hain deewaron pe kismat apni likhi jati hai isse humko jeene ki wajah milti jati hai to chalo school chale hum i'm sure you all must be missing your school days so okay chalo school chale hum i take you to school through assembly morning prayer followed by a hymn i call upon sashwati khare for morning prayer kindly join your hands close your eyes and repeat after me dear god father of all men we are in your presence at all times please enlighten our minds with true knowledge of you and fill our hearts with great love for you bless our country our school our teachers family and friends help us to serve our neighbors out of love for you now we shall sing the hymn showers of blessings Showers of blessings This is the promise of love There shall be seasons with fresh Send from the savior above Showers of blessings Showers of blessings Oh 
Education helps us to get our goals. Education can make our dreams true. Here, I would like to quote Swami Vivekananda's thought. Arise, awake and stop not till you reach your goal. Education is a powerhouse. Intelligence plus character is the true education. To elaborate this in detail, I request teacher Mariam to please share her views. Good morning, respected principal, Reverend Father Remedius Gonzalez, our manager, Reverend Father John De Silva, teachers, parents and my dear students. A hearty welcome to one and all for the current academic year 2021-22. I would like to begin with the famous quote by Nelson Mandela. Education is the most powerful weapon which you can use to change the world. So, with this view in mind, let's begin the current academic year with the theme, Education is the most powerful means to revitalize the world. Let me explain you the meaning of revitalizing the world. Revitalizing the world means a strong world, a healthier world, a world full of active people. And such a thing is possible only through education. Education is perhaps one of the most important ingredients to a happy, successful and constructive life. Yes, my dear students, in this pandemic where we switch to online studies, we must always remember knowledge is power. Learning is a never-ending process. Every human being keeps on learning till the end of life. Learning modifies your thinking capabilities and conception. Thus, your ideas keep changing due to it. You break the preconceived barriers with the changing mindsets. This change helps you to interact with others. You feel free to express your ideas and this is how education changes you. Your parents strive hard to see that you get the best education. They sacrifice their own desires to uplift you. Teachers try their best to promote better knowledge. Considering the efforts of teachers and parents, it's your prime responsibility to realize all the sacrifices your parents do for you. Education nurtures an individual thinking and supplies them with the ability to think, act and grow in life. Never keep things pending for tomorrow what you can do today. Be self-disciplined, honest, hardworking and develop positive attitude within yourself. Lastly, I would like to end up with the words of Brad Gerard. Believe in yourself. Be strong. Never give up. No matter what the circumstances are. You are a champion and will overcome the dreaded obstacles. Champions take failure as a learning opportunity. So, take in all you can 
and run with it be your best and don't ever give up wishing you all my dear students all the best for the current academic year stay home stay safe thank you as very well said by teacher mariam learning is a lifelong process so dear students keep your learning mood on ever and forever thank you teacher mariam for your wonderful speech now here we have one of the most senior teachers teacher shalin to welcome you all with her wonderful speech a very good morning to all after a very long time we have all assembled here with a zest to motivate to inspire to fill each other with positivity and to enjoy the fresh adventures of this new academic year 2021-22 the pandemic taught us so many important lessons and one among them is the importance of education many institutions and industries were put under lockdown in the entire world but could we in the same way put a halt to education certainly not though schools were globally shut down with billions of students out of classrooms teaching was not stopped e learning helped teaching and learning to reach remote areas digitally benefiting millions of students we had to find new educational technologies such as online lectures video conferences zoom meetings recordings etc which revolutionized educational teaching thereby creating an online movement in the history of education we here at fatima badlapur did a bit for the growth of our students though this online method was so very new to us teachers as well as students we rose to the situation because we believe that education is a powerful means to revitalize the world it makes us knowledgeable enough to know how to live life and handle bad situations education makes us right thinkers and correct decision makers thereby enabling us to create a sustainable planet for the whole mankind on that note i take this moment to thank our management our principal our manager all the teachers and administrative staff members all the students and parents for the cooperation and support extended throughout the year let us all continue our good work and make this academic year more productive creative and blissful for each one of us thank you and have a nice day thank you teacher shalin for your refreshing and outstanding speech and yes the last year was very tough for us but teaching didn't stop we ensure it that it will continue this year as well in more creative way dear students it's my privilege to introduce our new manager father to you all reverend father john de silva reverend father is a good singer a great educator and an ever smiling personality actually many of you must have met reverend father manager when we had when he had graced our fun fair in 2019 with his presence dear students reverend father manager is also eagerly waiting for your presence in school but till then let us listen to his wisdom words I request Reverend Father Manager to please address the students. Teacher Janice, would you please escort Reverend Father? My dear teaching staff members, the non-teaching staff members, the principal of this prestigious school. Thank you, Dr. Ramesh, for your service. And beloved students, at the very beginning, I would like to express my gratitude 
for extending to me a very warm, hearty welcome. As we begin this new academic year, 2021-22, I would like to extend to you all a very warm welcome. Education is not in which, the theme that we have taken for this year. Education is the most powerful means to revitalize the world. If we put in our efforts, we are students, we are students to revitalize the world in the best way possible to us. Let me remind you all of the famous words of the philosopher Aristotle. The root of education are beaten, but the fruit of education are sweet. In your adventure to march forward with zeal and courage to revitalize humanity and this world, I wish you all dear teachers and my beloved students and dear principals the very best. God bless your efforts. God bless our school. God bless us all. May our Lady of Fatima continue to intercede for you all as you journey in the middle of the year to educate with love and with dedication. Thank you. A great leader has a capacity to translate vision into reality. And we are very fortunate to have such an amazing leader who always transforms our on paper plannings and visions into reality. The person who has solutions for every problem. The person who sees impossible as I am possible. Yes, I'm talking about the head of the family and he is none other than our principal, Reverend Father Remedius. Father, can we have the pleasure to listen to your enlightening message? Teacher Leela, would you please escort Father? Respected Reverend Father Manager, teachers, students, and parents, a warm welcome to all of you for this new academic year 2021-22. At the outset, let us thank God for giving us this new academic year. Let's thank God for keeping us in good health of body and mind. Last year, due to the disastrous COVID-19, some of our dear ones have lost their lives. They couldn't make it for this year. As a homage and a respect for those dear ones who have passed away from us, let us whisper a small prayer that God may have mercy on their souls, that God may have compassion and grant them Eternal Paradise Dear students, COVID-19 has devastated the world and even today the fear lurks round us Future looks fearful and unpredictable. And yet, we are hopeful that it will pass away soon. That days will soon be better. Not like before, but better than before. This academic year, for us, we have the theme. Education 
a powerful means to revitalize the world. This theme will give us an added reason to take up our studies seriously. For COVID-19, the pandemic has made us realize that education spreads awareness of those basic things which are very, very essential for better and healthy life. It is science and technology, we all know, which has come to aid to eradicate this dangerous virus, COVID-19 and the pandemic. The scientists and their research institutes could come out with vaccines to save the world since they acquired correct knowledge through education. Dear students, the scientists, the other research people and the institutes have played their role to save the, the world. The future is yours. The world will certainly need your research and discoveries to save the world from further disasters. At this juncture, the theme we have chosen for this academic year, education, a powerful means to revitalize the world, is indeed a motivating theme for you to take your studies seriously. And so, dear teachers, parents, and my dear students, Let's begin this new academic year with a great hope in our hearts that we will overcome all sickness, all difficulties, and with the power of knowledge, revitalize the world with learning. God will certainly bless us as we move on, and I pray that God showers abundant blessings on each one of us that we will sail through this new academic year safely and achieve great success. May Our Lady of Fatima, our patroness, be with us and assist us. May God bless you once again and I wish you all a very successful new academic year 2021-22. Thank you. God bless you. Now it's time to invoke Our Lady of Fatima so that we have normalcy and we can unmask everything soon. the protocols which will help us in our journey from mask to unmask. Use mask compulsorily. Maintain social distancing. Use sanitizers. Wash your hands frequently for 20 seconds. If out, avoid touching anything. Avoid roaming out without reason. Avoid attending social gatherings. Eat healthy. And yes, Educate others about these rules and help in revitalizing the world. With this, I take your leave. Take care, be safe and have a wonderful year ahead.